Good and safe work practices are important before doing any type of welding. Always check for hazards in the workplace such as oily rags, flammable or combustible material near welding sparks. Ensure your workplace is clean, well lit, well ventilated and with appropriate firefighting equipment close at hand. Don't perform any part of this setting up procedure near a source of ignition or while smoking. Before starting, inspect all equipment for damage and ensure no oil or other contamination is present on the fittings, hoses and blowpipe. Pay particular attention to all connections. When using gas products, always read the labels and safety data sheets before use. Ensure both cylinders are restrained securely. Ensure that the regulators are in good condition and safe to use. In Australia, the pressure adjusting knob of regulators are colour coded to assist with fitting them to the correct gas cylinder. Black for oxygen, red for acetylene and orange for LPG. Attach the regulators to their respective cylinders and tighten sufficiently to prevent leaks. Fit the correct VOC flashback arrestor to both regulators, blue for oxygen and red for acetylene. For side entry cylinders, always make sure the acetylene regulator outlet connector faces away from the oxygen cylinder. Attach the hoses to their corresponding regulator end flashback arrestors. Blue for oxygen, red for acetylene. Open the cylinder valve slowly. Slightly screw in adjusting knobs of both regulators to clear regulators and hoses of any dirt and dust. Back off the adjusting knobs and close cylinder valves. Do not stand in front or behind the regulator when opening the cylinder. It's important to attach flashback arrestors to both ends, regulator end and torch end, as described in the Code of Practice for Welding Processes and AS4839. Attach the other ends of the hose to the correct oxygen, right hand thread, or acetylene, left hand thread, on the welding blowpipe. For brazing, select the correct welding tip for the job and screw into mixer. Unscrew the sleeve on the mixer to rotate the welding tip to the required position and re-tighten the sleeve. Check for leaks on all the connections made in the oxygen and acetylene lines. If a leak is detected, locate the leak by applying leak testing solution. Never use flames to locate leaks. For this demonstration, we are brazing 25mm diameter copper pipe and using Pro Silver 15 filler material. For cutting, you will need to set up the cutting attachment. Set the working oxygen pressure with the blowpipe oxygen valve fully open, the heating oxygen control valve on the cutting attachment closed, the cutting oxygen lever depressed. Release the cutting lever and set the working pressure for acetylene up to a maximum of 100 kPa. Purge each hose prior to lighting torch. Our cutting demonstration will use 8mm mild steel and a size 12 cutting nozzle. Our oxygen will be set to 220 kilopascals and acetylene to 75 kilopascals. Working with gas is as easy as BOC. Come and see us in store or check us out online.